Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. In this video, we will learn how to obtain the probability for a normal distribution by using Keyshear calculator. Consider the random variable x follows a normal distribution with mean 100 and variance 5 squared. 1a less than cumulative. If we are asked to determine probability of x less than 92.9, understood that the lower limit is negative infinity while the upper limit is 92.9. In order for us to obtain the probability, we can first press menu, look for the 7 function distribution, choose 2 normal cd cumulative distribution, lower limit since it's negative infinity, we can input a very small value, for example, negative followed by as many 9 as possible for accurate answer purpose. Press equal, upper limit 92.9. Press equal. Sigma is the standard deviation for this case is 5. Press equal. Mu mean 100. Press equal. Equal again to obtain the correct probability. If let's say we want to input the standardized value, which means that we take x minus mu divided by sigma, we have to take note that for a standardized random variable, z follows normal distribution with mean 0 and variance 1. So which means that when we input, we have to be careful. Instead of using the mean and standard deviation given by the question, we should use the random parameters. So we have equal again for the lower limit we can ignore since this is also less than cumulative. For upper limit, change to the z score 2.43. Sigma, be careful since this is standardized value, which means that we have 1 for standard normal distribution. Mu, 0. Press equal, we should obtain the correct probability. For more than cumulative, if let's say we are not going to input standardized value, we have to use back the random parameters given by the question. So we have equal again since this is more than cumulative. So which means that the value given is the lower bound. 92.9 upper limit change to positive infinity. Take as many 9 as possible. Sigma given by the question 5. Mu 100. Press equal to obtain the correct probability. For an interval, also the same, equal again to change the lower and the upper limits. So we have 92.9, press equal, upper limit 112.15, press equal. Since sigma and mu are exactly the same, so when we press equal, we should obtain the probability. D e, to obtain the inverse order, z score, the x value, we can go back to menu, distribution, 3 inverse normal. Arial here stands for less than cumulative. The calculator can only answer, provide the value that is only for less than cumulative, which means that only workable for less than. If let's say we have more than, we should change to its complement. So let's try for less than first. So we have less than 0 0.25. This is the area given by the question. So we have 0 0.25. Sigma and mu given by the question. So we should obtain the correct value. Press equal again. And for part two, more than cumulative. For more than cumulative, it's a must for us to obtain the complement. By logic, more than we have 25%, which means that last time we have 75%, which is 0 0.75. Press equal, then we should obtain the correct value, and we done. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.